This video is an ad for Disney Princess. You know what time it is. It's time to get ready for back to school. Let's make this year magical with a little Disney Princess style. Let's take a look at the Disney Princess Comfy Squad and get some back to school DIY ideas. Disney Princess Comfy Squad dolls are each sold separately. We have Tiana, Rapunzel, and Belle. Let's take them out of the box for a closer look. Out of the box, Belle comes with red glasses, a yellow top, red sparkly pants, red shoes, and she has a red book. Tiana wears a green top with a frog on it, purple leggings with gold details, green shoes, and she comes with a tiny picture of her and her dad. Rapunzel wears a purple t-shirt that says, long hair, don't care. She wears a pair of faux denim jeans, white shoes, and carries a bag of chips. Since Belle loves books so much, let's make bookends that we can use to display our dolls. I'm using pre-cut wood that I bought at the craft store. I have two large rectangles and one square. Glue the rectangles onto the square to make a small corner. Paint it. I'm using a soft lavender on the walls. Paint the bottom pink. Paint popsicle sticks gold. Glue them onto the walls to make golden baseboards. Glue more slightly higher up. Repeat to make two. Cut out pictures from the back of the box. Place them in small frames. Glue them onto the walls to make a mini room to display our dolls and use as bookends. The Comfy Squad has articulation at the head, shoulder, elbow, wrist, and hip. I think they are going to be pretty comfy in our bookend doll displays. Speaking of comfy, check out this back to school fashion by Roxy Girl. I got this whole Little Mermaid theme going on with the blue and white striped shirt. Ooh, patches. Paired with this Little Mermaid zip up hoodie matching sweatpants, pencil pouch, and backpack makes the perfect look for school. So comfy. Whoa, those clothes really do look comfy. I know, right? Maybe if we can find Ariel, we can get some sweatshirts too. I like your thinking. With Disney Princess Comics Minis, we have a chance to collect some of our favorite Disney princesses. This is Series 1. There are 12 to collect, and I can't wait to see who is inside. All right, we pulled off that layer, and here it is. Let's see if I can tell who it is through the packaging. No, I can't figure it out. Okay, let's just open it. Oh, it's the Beast from Beauty and the Beast. It comes with a stand, so they're easy to display. There's a mini comic strip and a collector's guide. Check, two more. Who is this going to be? Pocahontas with a comic. And the other one is... Cinderella. Too cute. We have another one. So exciting. And it is <laughs> a double. What are we going to do with two beasts? I have an idea. Remove the eraser from a pencil. Glue the base onto the end. Place the Disney Princess comic figure on the stand to make a fun pencil topper. But if you're still looking for Ariel, then look no further. This is Disney Princess Playdate Ariel. She is 32 inches tall. Every day is a playdate with Princess Ariel. Join Ariel and explore a world filled with adventures and treasures. Out of the box, she comes with a tiara, removable top, and skirt. The skirt looks like a mermaid tail. And she has a Dinglehopper hairbrush. This year is the 30th anniversary of the animated film, The Little Mermaid. So it's really special that we get a chance to look at this 32-inch Ariel. 
Wow, her hair is really soft. She has glass-like eyes and is fully articulated with movement at the head, shoulder, elbow, and wrist. She can also move at the hip and knee. With her size and articulation, we can totally use her as a study buddy. She can hold flashcards! All right, let's study. Area of a rectangle. A equals base times height. What is pi? 3.14. Yay! Check out the Disney princess. Aerial, music, and lights vanity. The vanity looks like a giant clamshell with seahorses on the side, strings of pearls, seaweed, and a large picture of Ariel. There are four shell feet on the other side to keep it stable when laying down. Let's push the button here to open it up, and there's Sebastian! There is a large mirror on the back, a drawer, ooh, there's stuff inside, a brush, a comb, a little curling iron, a tiara, purple shell earrings, a pretend bottle of perfume, it has little starfish on it, here's flounder on a jar, and there's a little makeup sponge inside. This vanity also comes with three hairbands. If you have an adult, place batteries inside of it and turn it on. When you open it, there is music and lights. And we could totally use this vanity to store our school supplies, like extra pins. When it's open, we can place pins right here, maybe a few pencils on the other side, place binder clips in the drawer, I found a pencil sharpener that matches perfectly! Let's put that in the drawer with some paper clips. Ooh, we must have sticky notes. We can place those right on top. Place a mini tape dispenser in the front with extra tape and some fun erasers. Ah, we're so organized! The perfect way to start off the school year. Thank you for joining us while we added a little Disney princess style to the school year. These pencil toppers are so much fun! Oh wow, his head moves. I can tell you right now, I am going to have a blast making pencil toppers with those Disney princess comics minis. I've already made a few more. And we hope you have a magical time this school year. And we will see you next time.